right, so what I have so far is I have the ability to uh, use different pressures down a little bit to my leg, kickstand, my leg out with hip movement, switch up this one in, lock down, and then we didn't work, but you also have the knee in and the butterfly hook. Bunch of stuff I can do with my legs. Uh, with my body, I'm out, in. Sorry, I'm out, in. With my hands, no underhook, no cross face, no pulling up on this side, and then on this side, no underhook. No underhook for him. If I'm playing that game, now I'm surviving pretty well. As I'm playing this game, I have the ability to switch my legs up, begin to create pressure, and pulling guard and other stuff starts to happen. Um, now let's create some uh, pressure from the posture. We're going to do two pressures, and it starts to open up the game. So as I'm working this game, and we're doing this stuff, pressure number one is going to be the upa, and it's going to be in that direction. So it's just a upa. Pressure number two is going to be uh, pulling my knees to my body and trying and taking and going over this way. So upa, work in, work in, upa, pull my knees to my body, come this way. So without they know me. Uh, pressure number one, upa. Pressure number two, roll. Pressure number one, upa. Pressure number two, roll. So I'm not even trying to pull full guard or anything. I just want to work keeping him from getting a cross face, underhook, no underhook here. Switching my legs up a little bit. Hip in, switching my legs up a little bit, keeping him out. Hip in, roll, hip in, roll, and just find that pressure. So the same drill we just did, Really concentrating on, on trying my different leg hooks and now adding a hip in pressure and a driving your knees and rolling the other way pressure. Just to add the pressure so you can feel the pressure from the posture. Okay?